gorgeous day, full of sunshine here in West Michigan and uh, able to not only soak in sunrises, but sunsets here today. This one from Grand Haven sent in by Bill and those high clouds that were out to the west have started to creep in this evening and they did impact that sunrise uh, sunset just a little bit. But in total, we have seen a ton of sunshine here for the first five days of February compared to the last 10 days of January. So this is sunshine in minutes, 14 minutes of sunshine the last 10 days of January. First five days of February, almost 1800 minutes of sun. It's been a completely different forecast here for this first week of the second month, and it's going to continue into tomorrow as well. We're starting to see some high clouds build in in downtown Grand Rapids. Some low level clouds are off towards Ionia and Lansing. Those have been there all day, and those are going to continue to move to the west tonight as the high clouds continue to move from west to east. That'll keep our temperatures in the upper 20s tonight, pretty much everywhere along the lakeshore, maybe a degree warmer. Uh, but that'll be close to our dew point. So again, we'll watch for some fog tomorrow morning. And there's those clouds right now continuing to kind of close in on the Grand Rapids area. Low level clouds in that moisture off of Lake Huron, as well as high clouds and mid-level clouds moving in as that high pressure continues to move to the east as well. So this evening we had seen clouds increase. We'll continue to see that overnight tonight. And then as we get into tomorrow morning, those will fade out once again. Should see more sunshine Tuesday afternoon. Pretty similar to what we had for uh, Saturday in terms of morning clouds and afternoon sunshine. Wednesday is going to be a little different. We'll finally see cloud cover a little more consistently throughout the day. It'll be more of a mostly cloudy day. And then as we get into Wednesday night, a warm front is going to approach us. Strong southerly flow. And that'll bring temperatures up a notch as we get into Thursday and Friday. Here's Tuesday's highs, 44 Grand Rapids, 45 Allegan and Kalamazoo. And again, touch cooler along the lakeshore. We're starting to get that lake breeze. But here's the records that we're going to be keeping a close eye on this week, especially on Friday. Looks like we're going to get within a degree or two. As of now, Grand Rapids forecast is actually expected to break that record of 55 degrees on Friday as we have 56 in the forecast right now. 55 on Thursday as well, but a lot of communities were into the 60s for records there on Thursday. So here's the system that's going to bring that warm air and the chance for some showers. I think we're going to see scattered showers on and off. Will not be a washout all Thursday afternoon and all of Friday, but it is going to consistently bring some on and off rain. As we go throughout the day on Friday, those showers will start to move to the east. A cold front will sweep through the region and we're going to see falling temperatures as well as breezy winds. It may bring the potential for some spotty, isolated showers Saturday and Sunday. But for now, things are trending fairly dry, but cooler air really will settle back in and a chance for rain and snow as we get into early next week. So starting to return back to winter, but a nice mild stretch here this week.